John Carroll. Hi, welcome to Caroline's Corner. I'm your host, Caroline Boniface. Today I have Miss Kelly Smith here with us to talk about Carol's Colors. Hi, Miss yeah. Smith. How Hi. are you? How are you? I'm great. Good. Why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself and your role here at John Carroll? So um, my main role here at John Carroll is I'm a college counselor, but I also um, advise and help students that are part of the Carroll Scholars. I have been at John Carroll for eight years in the college counseling role and have been a Carroll Scholar advisor for four years ever since it started. Great. Um, why don't you tell us a little bit about the Carroll Scholar Program? The Carroll Scholar Program is amazing. It is an exclusive program that is by invitation only for students who just really want to be leaders academically, um, to get involved in their school, and to really, you know, just enhance our community here at John Carroll. Great. Um, what do you find special about this program? Um, what really gets me most excited about our Carroll Scholars is not only do they excel academically individually here, they also really work well collaboratively with each other and other students in their class. Um, and it's just really cool to see that and to see them helping each other achieve. Awesome. Um, how do you think this program helps students prepare for college? So these students are also um, given the opportunity to be part of the AP um, capstone program, which allows them to take one of the most rigorous courses, course loads here that we offer at John Carroll. So they're taking the hardest level classes, they're getting involved um, both academically and socially and um, starting clubs, which is really fun to see. So they are really just kind of paving the way um, and really doing all that they can to prepare themselves for college. The AP seminar and AP research classes that they have to take are very writing intensive and they're set up um, very similarly in a college structure. So that um, in and of itself as well is preparing them for the rigors they're gonna find in college. Great, and my last question for you today, um, what advice would you give an incoming freshman who maybe is it, will be involved in the Carol Scholar Program and then maybe someone who's not involved? Um, I think the best piece of advice is just for them to get involved with something that they're passionate about and that they love. There really isn't one secret um, secret thing that they need to do to you know, get to where they need to be after these four years at John Carroll. As long as they do what they love and get excited about it, that is going to help them um, be successful in the future. Great. Well, thank you so yeah. much for being on today. No and we really excited. appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Matthias, how are you doing today? Good, how are you? I'm good, thanks. Matthias, tell us a little bit about yourself. Uh, so my name is Matthias. I am a junior here at John Carroll, and I am part of the soccer and the football team here. Awesome. Are you involved in any other extracurricular activities? Uh, I'm part of the STEAM program and the Carroll Scholar program as well. Awesome. Speaking of Carroll Scholar program, why don't you tell me a little bit about your experience in that program? So my freshman year, I had to take AP Human Geography with Mr. Fendrick and uh, AP Seminar with Mr. Fendrick as well. And junior year, I have to take AP uh, Research with Mr. or Dr. Ketchum. Awesome, and how, how's it been? Are you enjoying yourself in this program? Yeah, it's really preparing me for college because in college I'm gonna be writing very lengthy essays, uh, multiple uh, pages. Mm -hmm. So with seminar and research, I am really learning how to write an essay with proper uh, evidence and awesome. thesis. Great. Um, what would you say some of the challenges that you face are being in this program? So for research, our, our project is a year-long project and being able to time manage myself is very difficult mm -hmm. uh, because there's no deadlines for anything exactly so we have to spend the entire year time managing ourselves making sure we're staying on track and then submitting our paper on time in the night. That's a great skill to know that's for sure. Um, what would you say your favorite class at John Carroll is? My favorite class is AP Computer Science Principles because uh, in the future I'm interested in becoming a computer engineer great. so uh, being able to do AP Computer Science it's teaching me how to code uh, teaching me different parts about the computer and the internet so learning about those things really interests me. Cool um, and what advice would you give a incoming freshman who will be involved in Carol in the Carroll Scholar program? Uh, going back to the AP Research time management, you really need to learn how to manage your time because if you're going to be part of the AP Carroll Scholar program, uh, that is a very time-consuming and rigorous uh, program. 
So being able to time manage, especially if you play sports, because I play club soccer as well outside of the school too. So being able to do school, get my homework done, play school soccer and club soccer and school football as well. Being able to do all those things, I need to be able to time manage myself well, otherwise I'm gonna be crammed and not get stuff done. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for being on with us today and have a great rest of your junior year. You too. Thank you. Ryan, how are you today? Good, how are you? I'm good, thanks Ryan. Why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself first? I'm a junior here at John Carroll. I'm in the Carroll Scholar Program, the STEAM Program, and I'm currently the junior class president. Awesome, what extracurriculars do you do here? I play soccer here, varsity soccer, I'm the captain, and I'm also involved in the finance club and the aerospace club. Awesome, that sounds really interesting. Um, why don't you tell me about your experience in the Carroll Scholar Program? In the Carroll Scholar Program, I've taken some higher level AP courses with uh, the students that placed in the top 10% in the, on the high school placement test. And we work collaboratively and individually to do higher level thinking and research projects to for the college board that, oh, I don't know where I was going with that. Sorry. Um, <laughs> you wanna read that? Um, should we start from, like, tell me about your experience? Yeah, you can just keep going. We'll, okay. we'll just put a transition in. Okay. We'll right. So, where do we like, We can just restart that question okay. if you want. All right. Um, Ryan, tell me about your experience in the Carroll Scholar Program. In the Carroll Scholar Program, uh, I've taken a couple AP classes uh, that have really challenged me to work both individually and collaboratively with my peers that on various different research assignments, and I've learned a lot about topics of my own interest as I'm able to explore things that I choose to explore. Awesome. Um, what are some of the challenges you face with being in this program? It, especially as an underclassman, I have struggled to work with my peers, first of all, getting to know them, but it's really helped me develop great friendships as well as work with people that I don't know, which would benefit me after school when I have to work with students that I meet in college or in the workplace. Awesome. Um, what is your favorite class at John Carroll? I really love my physics class um, with Dr. Davidson. We do a lot of hands-on stuff and we actually apply all the physics concepts that we use into uh, making a rocket. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Um, how do you feel this program is preparing you for college and beyond? I feel like my collaborative work with my peers is definitely a great preparation and also the high intensity and ad adaptations that I've had to make uh, with the complex schedule that John Carroll has. Awesome. And then my last question for you today is, um, what advice would you give to incoming freshmen who maybe are going to be involved in the Carroll Scholar Program or just um, students who are coming into John Carroll? I would uh, suggest new students to not be shy. Uh, you're coming in with a lot of students from various different middle schools and you're guaranteed not to know a lot of people in your grade. And if you really put yourself out there and make new friends that you relate to or maybe even don't relate to, you're really going to find success here. Awesome. Thank you, Ryan. Hi, OK. How are Hi. you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. Why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? So I'm a sophomore at John Carroll, and I'm in the theater department. And I'm so happy. I love it so much. And I'm also in the Carroll Scholar, Scholar Program. Great. So tell me about your experience in the Carroll Scholar Program. My experience has been unique, to say the least. Uh, my freshman year, I started off virtual and then halfway through the semester we moved on into in-person and this year we're fully in person but there's always that looming threat of <laughs> going back on virtual and that is a little bit scary but I would say I do enjoy the experience a lot I feel like it's really I don't know how to describe it I feel like all the concepts that we've been learning last year we really apply them now like with human geography and, and building our art from what we learned in human geography and building our arguments now, I see a lot of that information coming back oh, and using it. That's awesome. That's great. Um, so what would some of the challenges that you face in this program be? Some of the challenges, I would say, is just it being an AP course itself. It's a lot of academic rigor, but it is worth it in the end. I feel like I am learning a lot of useful things. Awesome. And what would you say your favorite class at John Carroll is? <sighs> I know this is going to sound, I don't know, kind of coincident, like, kind of, I don't know. But my favorite class is AP Seminar. AP. I love it so much. I just love the idea of making all these arguments and actually having to find information to support it. I feel like it's really built my argumentative skills and also my public speaking skills. Great, yeah, tell us a little bit about, more about AP Seminar. What is AP Seminar? 
So AP Seminar is a course in which you learn how to write an argumentative essay. And yeah, really, that's about it. Okay. And you also present it for the end of the year. Okay, so are you working on this essay all year long, or? Well, this year, we well, this semester, we built upon learning how to write out our arguments and creating slideshows for it. And now we're starting to work and create our group projects. Later on in March, we should have our essays completed. So. Okay. And what is your group going to do for their project? We haven't decided it yet. We just found out yesterday. So okay. we still need to take some time yeah. to figure out what we want to do. Awesome. But we do have a couple ideas. Good. Um, and how do you feel that this program is preparing uh, you for college and beyond? I really feel like it's teaching me my public speaking skills, with, especially with seminar and next year with research and learning how to find great sources for things, great like writing academic papers yeah. and stuff like that. Um, so for incoming freshmen who are going to be in the Carroll Scholar Program or just any advice to any student coming to John Carroll, what would you, what would you share with them? I would say for anybody who's joining the Carroll Scholar Program, please study for human geography. I know you see the statistics saying that is such an easy course, but trust and believe me, you do need to study for it and just do it so that you can get those college credits. Okay. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Good luck the rest of the semester. And we really enjoyed talking with you. Thank you.